guys welcome to my channel super vegan with asta sharma and today i'm going to tell you that how can you deal with social anxiety and social pressure being a vegan when i ask about vegan stories to people they tell me the uh, negative experiences they have one of them is the social pressure because whenever they go out to have uh, to dine out with their friends most of them are you know uh, non vegetarians they eat meat and now vegans people who are vegans they feel no lonely they feel alone and they feel one of a kind and because of that i have seen people that they stop being vegan or they stop going out and uh, with their friends which is you know which is uh, yeah i i understand that this is uh, an issue this is a Uh, kind of a big issue when you feel lonely and you feel that you are you are the only person in the group who is vegan and who don't want to eat the meat and then of course there are some objections by meat eaters which we vegans need to face the questions and uh, the arguments they always happens so how can you deal with that how can you not care about it that because you are you think because you know that you are right you are doing the right thing so how can you not care about what other people are thinking about you or what others are saying you so i will give you three points three things which you can do to not care what other people are thinking about you first point stop making it all about you now we humans have a tendency to think that we are on the spotlight and everybody else is thinking about us and we are the lead character in the movie but the truth is we are the lead character in the movie of our life and everybody else is side character similar to it we are side characters in everybody else's life and they are the lead characters so if we are thinking that what others are thinking about us it is it is you know it is a waste of time and energy because they are actually not thinking about us because they are too busy to think that what we are thinking about them so even if you are talking to some meat eater going out with some meat eater and you are thinking that what they will think about you there is nothing to worry because they don't have enough time to think about you they are thinking about themselves <laughs> this is you know this is uh, really very important to understand that it does not matter that what people think about you because they are not actually thinking about you they are they even if they argue with you even if they say some some objections but still then like it's all gone it's all gone because you know you are doing right it is no matter it should not matter that whatever you others are telling you but you should follow your heart and you should do the things which you think is right coming to the second point change your questions now this is very important you know whatever kind of questions you ask yourself the same results you will get you in your life now when you feel social pressure and you will ask yourself that why these people are doing this to me why these people are saying this to me or should uh, am, am i uh, right that i am i uh, i'm considering this lifestyle am i doing something wrong or why i i hate everybody why uh, those people are stupid to not to understand this if you are asking these questions you will attract more and more people like this so stop asking this question and start asking these questions to yourself which has some solution which are solution oriented not problem problem oriented so when you go out next time ask yourself that what is the best way you can deal with that situation what is the best way you can be affirmed about it what is the best way that you can come up as the more as the most you know positive and uh st-
stable version of yourself and if you are you know you you are positive about this and you are stable inside and you know deep inside that this is right what you are doing it right is right then you will automatically get that mindset and then that this will change your response to these people who are maybe mocking you or who are uh, giving these objections when you go out and when your response will change towards them their response will change automatically so always remember instead of asking negative questions about yourself and about people around you shift those questions to positive and it will change your mindset and the mindset will change your reaction coming to the third point you have got to challenge yourself every day third point you have third point and most important point you have got to challenge yourself every day now this is important because you know if you do not challenge yourself you will stop growing challenge is growth if you want to grow as a human you have got to challenge yourself and take this as a challenge now next time will when will you go outside take this as a challenge that how can you most politely and in most affirmative way uh, tell that you want to have that those things you want to have vegan things you or you want to go to vegan restaurants or uh, nobody has that right to tell you that what you should eat so <laughs> this is uh, this will change uh, shift your you know shift your uh, mindset and uh, make you more affirmative about it if you challenge yourself every day and it will actually uh, you know whenever uh, consider an elastic band you when you stretch that elastic band it will uh, come to the uh, it will get stretched but it will come to its position again so your comfort zone is uh, similar to that elastic zone when you stretch it it will get stretched when you uh, <laughs> when you stop stretching it will come to the position to its actual position again so you have to stretch and stretch and stretch you have to keep stretching it until it snaps until you get the breakthrough this is well very very important so keep stretching it keep going out with your friends and keep telling them that yes you are a vegan and it is totally fine there is no nothing to make an issue of this so these are the three things you can do if you feel social pressure one is stop making it all about yourself second point is change the questions third point is uh, start challenging yourself every day if you are afraid of going into the, those social events go to those self social events and tell people that yes you are vegan and be proud of it so thank you so much for watching my video today and if you get any value of this you if you felt felt that this is helpful for you let me know in the comment box and like the video subscribe to my channel and thanks again for watching it i see you soon again bye bye